the Crabby's Handicap Chase is next. A two and a half mile naught to one forty handicap. The top one is Bobby XL for Graham Clutterbuck. All looks good. Joshua Sutherland, Blackmore Instrument, Martin Leadham, Bellagio Fenton, or Craig Allen Formation, Daniel French, False Horizon, Leon Van Rensburg, Little Miss Hot Stuff, Kevin Minahan, and Amethyst Lontana for Ryan Costello. So just eight then in this one. Let's get an aerial sweep of the track. And there the horses all called in, and away they go with Alethys Lontana. Just about the first to show. It looked like there was something at the start there that didn't um, didn't jump off. Oh, it was uh, all looks good, or it was false horizon. But there definitely looked to be something that didn't jump off there as they come down towards the first. And we see them over getting a bit of a long shot, and all looks good doesn't appear to be with the field at this point. So Amethyst Lontana's in the lead, Blackmore Instrument is second, Formation's third, then Bellagio Fenton, Bobby XL, Little Miss Hot Stuff, and then False Horizon. And keep an eye on the back when we get some different angles because all looks good is showing up at the moment as being in the race but doesn't appear to be there as they take that one let's have a look and see how far away they go and there's absolutely no sign whatsoever of all looks good at this point so he looked like he didn't start to me he was definitely there at the start as amethyst lontana made a bit of a mess of that one blackmore instrument jumped it well and goes up into second but just to go back to the beginning all looks good was definitely there at the start and when the rest of them moved off it did look like one horse had been left behind but when they're left behind they normally go a sort of gray color in that graphic up the top corner and it's still showing up as as a black type there at the moment so oh no, over the fourth back to the race and it's amethyst lontana in the lead from blackmore instrument in second formation is third Bellagio fenton is fourth then bobby xl and little miss hot stuff false horizon is the well, I'm going to call it the back marker because I don't believe that All Looks Good is actually taking part in this race as they take the fifth and they're all safely over that one. And this Lontana is in the lead and leads by about three as they race downhill. There's a mile and a half still to go. And at some point, we'll go past the starting point, won't we? So keep your eyes over a horse standing around doing nothing at the moment. They're <laughs> all safely over that one anyway. Uh, Amethyst Lontana is in the lead on Bellagio Fenton in second. Bobby XL is third. Uh, obscured by trees as we take that one. Uh, we're going to switch camera angles now. And Amethyst Lontana is the leader. And I still can't see any sign of all looks good anywhere at this point. So Bellagio Fenton is second. And Little Miss Hot Stuff on the inside. Then uh, Bobby XL and False Horizons. They take the water jump. And that's past the winning post then with a circuit to go. They've definitely been past the point from where they started. And there's no sign of all looks good. And looking back there, look see virtually all the way down the home straight and I can't see a horse racing so I don't think he's in it it's Amethyst Lontana who is in the lead on Bellagio Fenton in second as they take this next one then comes Bobby XL in third Little Miss Hot Stuff is fourth then a gap to Formation and False Horizon Blackmore Instrument has now dropped to the back and all looks good is goodness knows where so Amethyst Lontana then bizarre races right up until the very last week oh, we had a disappearing horse last week and this week we've got something similar although it didn't appear to disappear and as they take the tenth the thing that makes you think that it, it isn't racing but is invisible is the fact that it hasn't moved from the bottom well it being a joshua sutherland horse you wouldn't necessarily expect it to be last all the way around so they're taking the 11th and amethyst lontana is the leader from formation second, Bellagio Fenton third, then Bobby Axel is fourth, Little Miss Hot Stuff is next, and then a little bit of a gap to Blackmore Instrument and False Horizon. Amethyst Lontana showing the way home. As they skip over the 12th, just three more left to take then, and Amethyst Lontana is in the lead by a good two or three lengths so blackmore instrument is now making a forward move again swinging around the outside and coming with a good looking run then chasing that one is bobby xl bellagio fenton's got the inside but blackmore instrument's taking the lead down skips over that third last which is the final ditch and suddenly has now shot off for home with two and a half furlongs to race it's and formations of faller at the back there and appears to have been overtaken by all looks good so anyway blackmore instrument is in the lead coming down to the second oh he's gone straight through it blackmore instrument that surely presented the race to something else it's bobby xl who's taking advantage at the moment. Blackmore Instrument's trying to get going again. Then Bellagio Fenton over the last and Blackmore 
and drop that one really well. And now gets back into the lead. It's ahead. Bobber as they race up there. Up the hill. It's but Bobby XL. Blackmore Richmond. Blackmore Richmond going on again. But now Bellagio Fenton throws down the challenge. It's Bellagio Fenton that pulls away to take it. Bellagio Fenton wins this train race. Blackmore Richmond second. Then Bobby XL falterizes and doing this hot stuff. Amethyst Lontana is after that one. And for oh, there's all looked good, all looks good, just trotting round at the back. So, goodness knows what happened to that one. Uh, formation was a late fall up, but all looks good, just trotting round in his own time. Did he? Oh, that was a very strange thing to see there. But he definitely was at the start, and he was definitely at the finish. And let's have a look. So, Bellagio Fenton for Craig Allen is the winner. Blackmore Instrument for Martin Leland second. Bobby XL for Graham Clutterbuck third. False Horizon Leon Ravensburg fourth. Little Miss Hot Stuff for Kevin Meenan fifth. And All Looks Good was behind, last and hopelessly detached by halfway, outpaced. So, goodness knows what's gone on with that one. It doesn't say it was injured, but it definitely looked to me as though it didn't want to start the race. And it must have been a heck of a long way behind because we got a few long shots and there was absolutely no sign of it at any point until it passed the finishing post a long way last.